Yo, what's up guys? So for today, I'm gonna to be showing you guys a couple of tools that I use to upscale images for better resolution, for better quality. And so when it comes out in this printer, it'll be freaking on point, okay? Let's get right into it. So this is what I used to use. You go to deepimage.ai, you could Google it, search it up. I'll probably post a link below if it will let me. But yeah, uh, for pricing, you could either pay yearly, these are the prices, or you could do pay as you go. So this is what I did. I did 100 credits, which is 100 pictures, and you could just purchase now. So this is how you use the app. Deep image, select. So select the files, and then we're gonna pick this one. Uh, customers send it, it's a JPEG photo, of course. So, yeah, you could pick uh, remove background. I don't want to do that. Enhance face details. We're not doing face. So I'll just keep it as is. And we're just going to three exit. Okay. So you just click enhance. And then, oh, by the way, this is not using your, your graphics card on your computer. It's all cloud-based, so you don't have to worry about things loading. So this is real time. While that's loading, oh, there you go. And then I'll show here slowly the difference. Let's just do it for here. Okay, so. I don't know if you can tell guys, but I can't really focus. So that's after, and this is before. Hold on, there you go. Sorry, my screen is probably all pixelated. So that's before, and that's after. And it takes off a lot of the pixelation in it. So you hit download, and then now it's downloading. So that's one option. And I'm gonna show you guys another program that I got, which is the Topaz Gigapixel AI. This one is $99 just for the software. There's no subscription fee or anything like that. So we're gonna use the same file open and then now it's updating which this takes longer because it's running through your GPU or your RAM and let's see how much is it using up performance using up 30% of your GPU and right there basically a gig so now it's updated it's done save image save as a PNG yeah we'll save as a PNG and now it's gonna load up again and it's gonna use up more of your RAM and more of your GPU. Again, this is Gigapix AI from Topaz Labs. Okay, so this is the original. Let's zoom in to the A. All right, you can see it's all pixelated like that. And this is the program that I use, which is the Topaz AI. Look at that, guys compare those two. If I go even closer on the original, if I go closer on the upscaled version. So that's what a AI upscaler does guys like. And then at the same time, you don't have to go to Illustrator and come here and vectorize it. Uh, let's do high 
photos, expand. You don't have to come into Illustrator and vectorize it, you know what I mean? And see all like these weird colors. So that's the benefit of it. So I just tossed it into Photoshop. You wanna make sure you go to image, you go to image size, and you wanna make this over 300 if you're printing. And then the inches, that's too big. We'll just make it 30. Yeah, that's it. And then now it's so easy for you to get the magic eraser tool and delete the background. So why is it beneficial for you and me? Because I figured this out that you know, I needed something that could upscale the image because people keep sending me these freaking goddamn JPEGs, right? And I'm like, how can I get this image to work right without me having to redo everything or even eventually me having to tell the customer no and I lose the job, okay? So this boosts up and enhances the pictures. You know, you could be a photographer and if it's blurry, you could use that as well but it's good for our business for printing. So the image quality is way better. The customer satisfaction is there. Uh, it also save your time. It's gonna save your time from doing your other tasks. So you could just literally have this thing run on the side while you're doing other things. So save your time for uh, productivity. You could be running other tasks while that's running oh also if you don't have a built computer like i do let's just say you just have uh, a regular desktop pc or a laptop it is wise to just go towards the the deep image online one rather than buying this program because this can eventually uh slow down your computer by a lot so also yeah so that's what I use to upscale images. Times are different now, you know what I mean? There's a whole bunch of artificial intelligence, AI. If you don't know what I talk about AI is, it's called artificial intelligence. But there's a whole bunch out there that can help you out, like in your daily tasks, your business. There's this thing right now that I'm looking into, which is Zapier, which can automate all of the replies to my emails, to my Instagram, to my Facebook, without me having to do things, you know what I mean? So that's crazy. Look up Zapier. If you don't keep up to date with these new technologies coming out, you're gonna get left behind. Seriously. Uh, yeah, everybody talks about AI is fucking scary. It's gonna take over, blah, blah, blah. Like worry about what's happening now. You know, you worry about the things that are gonna happen when it happens. People are saying the market's gonna crash. Market's gonna crash. Like freaking six months ago like it has, still hasn't crashed if you if you want to buy that printer just fucking buy that printer that you want to buy or whatever equipment you want just buy it already if it crashes then deal with it <laughs> you know what i mean so yeah that's that i hope you like the video i'm gonna i think my next video is gonna be me making cut lines on versaworks or I mean, cut line on Photoshop to Illustrator and put it to VersaWorks just for like the die cut stickers and weird shape stickers. I'm gonna be doing that because I think I do mine in a different way than others. So yeah, thanks for watching for real, for real. If you guys haven't checked out my shirt yet, take a look at this. Impala, baby. Do I want one? No, I want this. Later.